we continue to tax small businesses and individuals so that we can hand out big money to big business. Corporate bailouts, instead of taking care of the real job providers in the state of Illinois that are our small businesses and our individuals. So by voting for this, you're voting for big business bailouts at the expense, at the expense of our small businesses that are struggling to get by. Vote no. Create more well-paying jobs. It cuts the red tape to expedite job creation. Continues our successful attraction of high growth industries. And incentivizes new and existing businesses across downstate Illinois. As a former businessman and now as a governor, promoting our state to businesses across the globe. I can tell you that the economic policy trajectory that Illinois is pursuing is welcome news to those folks that I get to talk to outside of our state. They see that we are on sustainable long-term growth path that is making Illinois more and more attractive. Over the last few years, our state has seen record business formation nation-leading expansions and incoming relocations, job growth, and corporate investment. Our Illinois uh, focus on a business-friendly environment uh, has meant uh, good things for everyone across our state. And entice businesses to come here by offering them tax incentives and telling them your taxes will be lower. Yet later, we have a bill HB 4951, which is promising to raise taxes on business to $700 billion. Or what, $700 million, almost a billion dollars. Let's not waste our time, folks. If we're going to vote that into place, if you're not seriously considering voting no on the tax increases, there's no sense in doing this. We can dangle this in front of whomever, but when they know they're going to get taxed at the end of the day, they won't come. So if you're serious about this, if you're serious about jobs coming to Illinois, about opportunity for our people, then vote for this. Vote no on the tax increase bill, and let's start working on improving our business climate in Illinois. In prominence and achieved greater status as a global economic powerhouse. We have a lot to brag about in this state. And today is about more than just tax credits or incentive packages. It's about the continued revitalization of our communities and of our economy. The investments that we make today in downstate Illinois, in quantum computing, in semiconductor development, film and TV production, electric vehicles, and so much more will open up paths for businesses and workers for generations of Illinois families. And in doing so, anchor thriving communities from Cairo at the far southern tip of the state of Illinois to Chicago. 